Properly loading and securing vehicles is critical to the safe operation of your DinoJet chassis dyno. Here, we will demonstrate the correct procedure for each type of vehicle. First, you will need the following parts. Verify your computer is running. Then activate the dyno brake by pressing the red button on the pendant. For all-wheel vehicles, measure the wheelbase of the vehicle and adjust the four-wheel drive dyno to that dimension before driving on. For above-ground dynos, drive the vehicle onto the lift, then raise the lift to the necessary height for the dyno. Verify the lift locks engage when you lower the lift to the dyno. Drive the vehicle onto the dyno, taking care to align it perpendicular to the rollers. Stop when the drive axle or axles are centered on the drum. Once you are positioned properly, shut off the engine, place the automatic transmission in park or the manual in first gear, and set the parking brake. Place the provided tire chocks on both sides of the non-drive wheels. Don't try this on all-wheel drive vehicles. Tie-down straps should always be connected to the vehicle's solid axle or suspension control arms. Be careful to keep straps and tie-downs clear of axle half shafts, brake lines, and other non-structural components. For rear-wheel drive vehicles, attach two tie-down straps from your anchor points directly to the rear of your vehicle and two additional straps at an angle as shown. Then attach two additional straps directly to the front. For front-wheel drive vehicles, start with two tie-down straps from your anchor points to the rear of the vehicle. Then attach two straight straps to the front of the vehicle. And then add two additional crisscross straps at the front. All-wheel drive vehicles should be secured with two straight and two crisscross straps on each end. Tighten the tie-down straps evenly, making sure that the drive wheels remain centered on the drum. Once the vehicle is secured, release the brake on the dyno and the vehicle's parking brake. Start the vehicle and slowly accelerate in gear until the drum is turning slowly. While it is slowly rotating, verify the vehicle is correctly aligned and stable. Check all straps. Ensure the vehicle is tracking straight on the dyno and the loading process is complete. For Dyno Tech and sales support, call us toll free at 800 992 3525 or visit us online at dynojet.com.